Hey guys, I Heart Movies here, and Mallow is really not a tadpole on Let's Play Super Mario RPG. Gasp! Say what? Big ol' shocker of the game released right out the bat. Mallow is not a tadpole. And why is he not a tadpole? Well, we'll find out in a little bit. Oh, okay, a little bass floating down from the falls. Pete and Sign saw a little baby staring right at me. The name Mallow was written on his belt. Aww. Oh, there you go. That's where Mallow came from. Well, don't know exactly where he came from, but somewhere elsewhere in the world. A little piece of fluff. A little more than marshmallow fluff. In some far off land. Well, yeah, we don't know where he's from yet, but we'll find out soon enough. Well, not soon enough, but later on, actually. And of course, more crying. Aww, Mallow's sad. He's not a tadpole. Mallow! No crying! Yeah, they're out there somewhere, Mallow, so pucker up, pucker up, whatever it is, and don't cry, you'll find them somewhere. Oh, wait, what? Hi, I'm Mario. Hi. Can I help you? Oh, yeah, of course. Mallow's very, very handy, so gotta have him along. Yay! Alright, then go to Rose Town when they need your help. We can do that. Now, uh, before we leave, let's go ahead and talk to Frog Fuchsia again real quick. Maybe a snack will cheer you up. Well, don't we have to have a snack along with us? As a matter of fact, we do! You had the picture pie a while ago, and we can put it to use right about now. Ooh, to the staff I use, and he was Mallow's age. Hey, that's convenient. Finally, a new weapon for Mallow, maybe, perhaps? Yes? The Froggy Stick. That's wonderful. <laughs> Yay, we did a Froggy Stick! Go ahead and put this on Mallow real quick. Yeah, much better than uh, going bare fist, of course. Tap power by 20 points. Nice. There you go. And with that, we are off. Off the lawn, jumping on tadpoles and whatnot. Boing, 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 boing. And with that, let's go. Let's stop Rose Town. Or, okay, Rose Way. That works too. Alright then, Rose Way. A little in between part before Rose Town. You can't jump on or off when the block is blue. Try and jump when the block turns yellow. Okay. So easy enough jump on you know, jump on it when it turns yellow. There we go. And just move along these pretty easily. Get mushroom right down there. Uh, let's see here. Before we go to the top left, let's go down to the bottom left and get a flower. That should be number 31. Correct? Yes. How many flower tabs by any chance? Uh, no, not right now. Okay. Anyway, you have a new enemy up here. If I can fight it, I'll, I'll fight him later on. Anyways, don't worry about it too, too much. Anyway, this right here, this part is annoying. I will explain why momentarily. First off, new enemies, if I can actually get them. Here we go. Alright, then two new enemies, actually. We have a Shy Guy, classic Mario enemy, and a Star Slap. These guys, nothing really too hard, really. Um, let's just, just go for the um, Star Slap first, because he has uh, Recover. So, take him out first. Does, eh, not really that hard. Time to take him out easily enough. But, ooh, once again. Yay. Knock, knock, shell. Hey, yeah, Malice Party did actually it's the same time he does Mario's hammer, by the way, so. Yeah, once you see this the staff drop down the first time, press A again for an extra hit, and you'll deal more damage. So easy enough there. Yay, we win. And yeah, I want to clear out these two platforms first thing. So let's go and take out this guy real quick. So, yeah, there's a chest in the top left corner there that's extremely annoying to get. Now I mentioned right now there's a frog point inside of it. So if I can get it on camera, that'd be wonderful. But if I can't, and We'll see what happens. It's, it's annoying to get for sure. I've, I've tried many times to get it and failed a lot, though I, I have done it before, so let's keep that in mind. But yeah, if I don't get it now, um, I'll probably just do it off camera, so it's not a huge deal, so. You know, maybe we'll get lucky and I'll get it. Who knows? Don't know until you try. You can't just see, can't just see until you try, so. Alright then, easy enough there. The enemies around here really aren't too hard, to be honest, so let's keep that little tidbit in mind there. So yeah, jump on this platform here if I can actually land on it. No. Jump. There you go. Now, the key is you have to jump on the next platform, going left and right over there, then jump on and grab the chest. So, uh, let me see here. That. Nope, got it. I did get it. Yeah, this might be a little hard doing this like, on camera while I'm performing and all that, so... But I'll do it a couple tries. So maybe I'll get lucky. Yeah, if I don't get it here, I'll just come back later um, on my own time and get it, so don't worry about it if I don't get it right now. Huh. Yeah, I want to try to, um, yeah, if you jump up and get, get in the blocks way, you'll disrupt their path a little bit, so slow it down a little bit, so they can line up a little easier for you, so. 
Ah, I almost got it. He kind of sucks at you. You think you'd have it, and then you kind of, you kind of back up a little bit. Like, you don't think you have it, but yet you actually do, and you just kind of get paranoid and whatever, so kind of annoying, actually. I'll try once more. Give it one more good shot here. I didn't get it. Okay, I'll come back for it later. Don't worry about it. Yeah, it's just a frog coin, so... Never mind that. So anyway, up over here, and off to the right. Here we go. Alright, the new enemy right here, a little bandit dude. If I can actually get up to him, there you go. Yeah, these guys are pretty powerful, actually. For right now, you throw 6 damage on the time defense, and then you also throw a knife at you that can deal as much as 10 HP, I'm pretty sure, so... Okay, these guys are pretty easy, actually. Yeah, they're fairly weak. I mean, HP-wise, they have low HP and all that. Okay, they do a lot of coins, though. One guy did 10, sprints, or 10, 10 points and 5 spring points. That's pretty nice there, so... Um, Shy Guy, yeah, I'll fight you later. Um, am I close to level by for any, anybody? No, I'm not even close. Yeah, I might come back and fight these guys off-camera or whatever for some more experience points. We'll see what happens. And yeah, they run away a lot as well, so don't worry about that. So, four levels of just one Shy Guy. And go lag, knock, knock, shell. It's probably just because I'm using SNES 9X. I mean, I wanted to use ZSNES because I've used it before, it works really, really well. But I just can't deal with the sound. Like, the sound of this game was just way, way off. I'm not really sure why, but it, was, it sounded horrible. I was not going to deal with that. So, yeah, but it's not that bad, so I, I don't want to bother with that anymore. So, let's just move on. So, anyway, new area down over here. Let's see, make your way down this way. Um, get down to the bottom right of next destination. Although, did I miss a flower up there? I thought I saw one on the uh, platform up there. Uh, no, my imagination. Okay, there's points around here as well, but I'm not going to bother. Coins are very easy to get in this game anyway, as you've already seen, so... Okay, we have a bunch of chests around here with Shy Guys on them, so... Probably gonna be a handful of random battles coming up here, but oh well. There's a couple of enemies around here to fight as well. Including this guy, we have the Snapdragon. Let's actually go for him first, because he's rather annoying. He is vulnerable to fire too, by the way, so I want to keep that in mind. Although, actually, let me try Thunderbolt real quick. Let's see how that does against these guys. Um. Uh... No, not too bad, actually. That wasn't even a time hit, and it did pretty good damage, so... Oh, I had to scratch my nose there. I missed the time in there, so... <laughs> Oops. Oh, yeah, these guys are pretty easy. You shouldn't really need to heal that much anyway, so... Yeah, time hits work very easily enough, and very, very efficient, effective, blah, 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 blah. And there you go. And, yeah, they have a slingshot. Why? I don't know. It's a Mario game, don't question it. It's like wondering why Mario has a shell for a weapon. Although, that actually makes a little more sense, because he's used shells before. So... Alright then, anyway. So you got a bunch of coins around here. Um, I want to try to avoid the Shy Guys as well, just because they're annoying. Oh, Recovery Mushroom. I meant to say that for later, but I kind of forgot where it actually was. Like, placement chest-wise or whatever. So, oh well. Ow, that kind of hurt. Ow, that kind of hurt too. Yeah, note to self, um, increase attack and defense, and that's a love for these guys. They can use it. Well, maybe I'll do HP. I'm really not sure. I'll have to see how their stats look. Uh, Doom Reverb, or Reverb, or whatever, that's just science to you, I think. I've already seen it before, I'm pretty sure, this episode. Yeah, so, don't worry about that. Run away, yeah, you run away, you run away, yeah, you run away with your little flute flutter thing. Whatever floats your boat. And hit with stick, and boom, win. Stick, bigger than slingshot. Write that down, it's true. Anyway, more coins. Yeah, I want to avoid the shy guy, so like this GTFO from the uh, coin block place thing. Okay, yeah, I'll, I'll come back to you in a little bit. Let's see, uh, there's, there's a bunch of one coins around here anyway. Or ones and blah blah blah, so. Yeah, oh, another one over here. Let's actually, this is the last one in this part here. We have Arachne. Nor near as much HP as they do in Final Fantasy IV, thank god, so. These guys, a uh, decent amount of HP, uh, kind of high defense as well, and they can poison you too, so they're, in general, a, ha a hassle. And yeah, poison is just a nuisance, really. We have timed hits, worked enough as always. I need to stop saying that because we already know that, so boom, dead, easy enough. Yay, we win! Right, then this hits some more coins real quick that the Shy Guy will move, which he probably won't. Okay, so I jumped and got the coin block, got the chest, and then, oh, God, whoops, whoops. Sorry, I hit, um, one of my other, other buttons on my keyboard and messed up. Sorry about that. It happens, deal with it. <laughs> yeah, anyway, yeah, you die. Um, I actually need to heal Mario real quick, so let's go for an HP rain. Let's see if I, if I can time this right, so that'd be wonderful. HP rain! That smile is very, very freaky looking. 
There you go. For 48 HP, even. Perfect. Slingshot. Ow. Chomp. Ow. Oh, hey, hey, blocked it. Oh, you suck. Like, boom. You gotta love how, st uh, sh how sticks and shells are effective weapons. Not really sure how, but again, it's a Mario game, so don't question it. Right then, you should be dead with this attack, I would hope. You weird little spider thing. Yeah, you're not dead yet. That's just not cool. Like, why would you do that? Like, come on, you're in this game to be killed by shells and sticks. So, like, come on now. There you go. I knew you to die. Thank you. I love how I'm so polite when asking enemies to die. Like, seriously. And that's the last point from there. Let's grab the... Okay. I'll clear all, all these guys real quick. Not a big deal. Either that, I actually may skip the chest because there's only one more point left in each of them anyway, so... I don't know, it doesn't really matter. You know, do this episode, uh, in advance, um, again, this is part of my whole recording vault thing, um, imagine not sure when this will be uploaded, maybe today, as in Tuesday, the 18th, maybe tomorrow, Wednesday, the 19th, I'm really not sure. Um, but yeah, we'll see how it goes. Yeah, I'm only gonna do a couple episodes of this because, um, I, I need to have Shin Reiner call me next, for our next character later on in the game, so we'll have to do that later on, so... I'm going to record as many episodes as I, can, as I can fit in for right now. So, it's only probably going to be like two or three, I'm thinking, so. Uh, if I can, yeah, move past the uh, Leaf Mario, there you go. Yeah, it should be the last battle of this part, actually. So, let's go take down the Snapdragon first thing. Or at least soften up, soften up a little bit first. And then Mallow, let's not do Caps Lock. Uh, no, not HP Ring. Nope. Let's go Thunderbolt, please. Please, there you go. There you go. Oh, it still didn't die. Wow. Maybe you should increase Mallow's special stat, and uh, maybe that'll help, they'll help it out a little bit. But, oh well. Shell to the face! Boot to the head! Etc, etc. Alright then, yeah, you launch your slingshot, and... Okay, yeah, come on. Next turn, please. With more lag. Well, I wonder if I should, I should try... I uh, wonder if I should try recording something else for this. Because apparently, computer can't handle this or whatever, which is annoying. I, I don't care. Okay, anyway, with that, we are done! Yay! And, oh, what's going on up here? Oh, jeez, stop. Oh, hey, it's Bowser! How did he get here? Um, okay. I'm not really gonna question how, but, boy, well, at least it's okay, that's, that's something. Shelled warriors, quoted sorcerers, and of course, last but not least, Groundling, Groundling Goombas. Okay, that works. All right then. Well, hey, at least you're okay. But yeah, where's um Princess Toadstool? She has to be around here somewhere. March, march, march. Well, let's see. Um, must be on the way to Bowser's Keep. Well, they have a long way to get there. So, okay, just ahead. So let's go. Back onto the world map and right over to Rose Town. Let's see what's going on here. People need our help, apparently. Whoa! Holy shit! Um, an arrow to the head. That kinda hurts. Oh, that's a huge bummer. Oh, wow. Um, let's get okay, note to self. Don't get hit with an arrow. Like, don't. A shooting star? A star piece, perhaps? Ow. Yeah, there's uh, people you talk to around here, once you're done with them, um, they get hit with an arrow, so it kinda sucks. Well, this guy's already been hit. <laughs> That's what she said. He kinda looks stoned, doesn't he? He's like, ugh. Anyway, oh, hey, Toad Dude. Aww. Uh, okay, sure. So, I'll just borrow your head if you don't mind. There you go. Right then, and we have some chests here. We have some. We have a flower, and another flower. Yay, that should bring us up to 33? 4? 33, perfect. Alright then, and up here we go, and here's your idiot son. Oh, the treasure! Ooh! Wonder where said treasure is. Anyway, you just hop on that uh, button right there, and they'll load a staircase. So let's go down here. Well, my treasure's okay. Um, yeah, you want to say, I wouldn't say so. You want to be honest. Because they'll give us a little, little hint for later on that we'll want to keep in mind, so. Yeah, that's kind of my fault. I'm sorry, I got carried away. I mean, they're flowers. I, I, I can only, I'm the only one who can use them, really. So, to enter the forest, when you hit an area with four paths, go left, left, straight, right. Yeah, just remember that for later. And also, um, 
Keep in mind, this is from Mario's perspective. So when you reach the four-way, you'll come out one way, you look left. And then next room you pop out, you want to go to Mario's left, then Mario's straight, then Mario's right. So just yeah, keep that in mind. We'll surely find something nice. Ooh, okay, we'll keep that in mind for later then. Let's go and do a little, it's more, a little more exploring first thing. What else? Like, what's going on around here? Like, what's with the arrows? Like, where are they coming from? Um, go outside. You can see he has an arrow in his head. Well, not an arrow, but he's like stone off his ass. What's going on over here? Oh well, yeah, I would say so. But okay, well, better you than I guess the kids. Makes sense. Uh, yeah, arrow storming from the sky is pretty dangerous, I would say. So, uh, let's see here. Uh, yeah, that would be nice, but no, better him than you, so. Anyway, uh, that's pretty much all we can do around here, so let's go... Actually, let's go up here first, thing. If I can jump up here, that'd be wonderful. There you go, and get this chest for another flower. Now, if we go up here, I think there's another flower. Hey, oh, Frog Point. Okay, that's our next hidden chest. I think that's number... Four? I think, I don't remember, actually. Anyway, let's go and uh, buy some stuff first, thing. Actually, um, yeah, I'll do this. I'll do this right now. I want to buy a thick shirt and thick pants uh, for Mario and Mallow, and then I want to buy um two fearless pins actually. A uh, one for Mallow, and then one for character that we did that we did later on. So, going to put these first thing. Yeah, they're much better. Uh, not much better, but better than uh, what we have now. So, yeah, put that. Yeah, Mario, keep them on the jump shoes for now. Um, yeah, thick pants for Mallow, and the fearless pin. Yeah, that prevents the yeah, fear attacks, and it's also better in defense and magic defense. So we're gonna keep that around. Um, let's see, sell the hammer, shirt and pants, and then keep the pins around for later on, so there you go. Let's see, yeah, we have an uh, item shop around here, too. Um, don't really need anything, though. Um, I'll buy a pick-me-up just in case, but that's pretty much, pretty much all I need here. So where are all these arrows coming from anyway, and like, who's launching them and all that? And what about the star piece you found here? Or heard of? We'll find out next time on Let's Play Super Mario RPG. This has been Iron Movie Sign Off, guys. Have a nice day, and thanks for watching.